Yeah, it's my first time here in India. Um, it was a bit of an eye-opener in the beginning. Everything's very interesting and intriguing and, and to dive in the step well was something very, very different. It combines everything, a little bit of history, it's just a beautiful location, really tricky too. Amazing, one of, one of the best locations I've seen so far. The main challenge of diving in, in a location like this is, is a small area for landing, you know. Uh, you have to make sure you're right in the center of it. There is actually some steps underwater that you need to be aware exactly where they are. Uh, you can't push too far. Uh, we have to make sure we analyze every single detail and, and take that into consideration. My first impression was wow and I was quite nervous. Yeah, it was, it was quite challenging, but uh, you know, I, I always love a challenge and, and that's the one thing I love about the sport is, is um, the different locations, the, the, the different scenarios that we're put in to, to figure out where is, is good to dive and whatnot. You know, the impression of visiting uh, India is, it's amazing, you know, it's just, uh, it, it's like a, a roller coaster ride of, of like senses, you know, it's, it's a lot of colors, it's just a lot of people, a lot of action, you know, big contrasts everywhere. I mean, it's really exciting. At the local market, wow, that was, uh, that was uh, organized chaos really, but it was, it's, it's super nice, you know, if I've not really experienced anything, anything similar to India. It's, it's got its own, own flavour and it's so busy, and, but the people at the same time are so peaceful. I'm here with Rhiannon Eplant. She's uh, the World Series champion, multiple World Series champion. I mean, she's just awesome. It's nice to see that level of confidence, that level of technique, control, you know, you, you don't see that in too many athletes, you know. It, it, it's nice to see an athlete like that and, and to be able to share uh, some dives with her is just a great honor. I love to, to do projects with Orlando because he might not realize it, but I'm actually learning, learning a lot from him and he's always you know, looking wisely at, at, at the dive location and sussing everything out. We can have scuba divers on the side and the apnoe guy on the edge. And I see the way that, that he that he handles those situations and, and I learn, I pick up small small things from him. So, and he's a great person to, to be around. We took some tuk-tuks around the city and uh, it's just beautiful. I mean, we got to, to see the whole city, you know, from the top and it's, uh, it's nice, you know, it's just all these narrow uh, walkways where you can go through these beautiful houses on both sides. The color, you know, I like that. It's very bright. It's, it makes me really happy, it makes me feel good. interesting experience it's my first time on a camel so it's always nice to do something new and uh, you know to come out here in the desert and, and escape the the hustle and bustle of the of the city downtown near the near the step well is feels amazing and there's a beautiful sunset to top it off so it's really nice you don't get to do that too too often uh, riding a camel and just enjoying the real culture you know this is this is what they've been doing for a long time you get a, a real taste of, of what being in Jodhpur or being in India is. I really didn't know what to expect coming here to India but uh, I really like it. 